Being socially normal is a complex and nuanced concept that can vary greatly depending on one's cultural, social, and personal background. Normalcy refers to the behaviors, beliefs, and values that are considered to be acceptable or typical within a particular society or group. This can include things like adhering to social norms, conforming to gender roles, and being respectful of others. However, it's important to remember that what's considered normal can and has changed over time and may differ across cultures. Normalcy can often be associated with certain sets of rules or expectations that are established by a dominant element of society. These rules and expectations can define what is considered typical or acceptable behavior and can shape how people interact with one another. They can include things like standard conduct, customs, and traditions, as well as laws, both civil and religious, that govern our behavior. By providing a set of guidelines on how to behave and interact with others, being normal can help people navigate life and make sense of the world around them. Feeling and being normal is important to us because it can provide a sense of belonging and acceptance within any given community. When people conform to the norms and expectations of their community, they may feel more connected to others and less likely to be rejected or ostracized. Additionally, feeling normal can provide a sense of security and stability in one's environment. When people feel that they understand and can predict the behavior of those around them, they may feel more comfortable and at ease. Beyond fitting in and feeling a sense of belonging, being normal can also have practical benefits. Adhering to social norms can make it easier for people to understand their private or professional surroundings. It can also help them to predict the behavior of others and make them feel more in control. Conforming to social norms can also assist people in avoiding negative consequences, such as discrimination or mistreatment. Many people seem to believe that being normal is a sign of mental and emotional health and that deviating from the norm can be a sign of a problem. Being normal can be considered an attractive quality in some contexts because it can indicate that a person is well-adjusted, reliable, and able to get along with others. Behaving in a way that is considered typical can make a person appear more trustworthy, predictable, and easy to be around. However, being normal may not be seen as an attractive quality, particularly if a person is seen as being conformist or lacking in individuality. In creative or innovative fields, being too normal may be seen as a disadvantage. In those cases, being unique, unconventional, and standing out from the crowd may be more attractive. Do you want to be predictable or unique? Being normal can limit our ability to create and innovate in a number of ways. When people conform to social expectations, they may feel less inclined to deviate from what is considered typical or acceptable. This can make them less likely to take risks, be creative, or think outside the box, making them more likely to accept the status quo and less likely to question it. This can lead to a narrow perspective and a lack of new ideas or ways of thinking. Being normal can create pressure to conform and to be accepted by others which can then lead to a fear of failure or rejection. This fear can discourage people from trying new things or experimenting with new ideas. Being different can help people stand out in their private and professional lives when they can present themselves as more memorable and distinguishable. There is no normal in how we look. We're all different, so why not project the differences within to the outside world? This can open new doors for purer relationships and attractive opportunities. Being different can help people to expand their knowledge and understanding of the world and help them to develop a more well-rounded perspective. It can also aid people in being more resilient, adaptable, and confident in the face of change. People who are different may be more likely to think outside the box and challenge the status quo, leading to new discoveries and breakthroughs, eventually leading to the establishment of new norms. Somewhere in the vast universe of our behavioral variations, there is an exact yet dynamic equation of normal for each one of us. Normal is there for us to discover and evolve with over the duration of our lifetime. But this equation is different for all, and your mission is to discover where your equilibrium lies. 
what rules you want to follow and which you don't. Society has increased these sets of rules and expectations for us and made it difficult to behave outside of convention. Being different, though, doesn't mean that one should reject social norms and customs, but rather to be open-minded, non-judgmental, and always willing to question the status quo. So find your own norm.